Hello, welcome to the Sloan Zone. Today I wanted to talk to you about Harry Potter. You know, this little guy right here. My wife got me that for a present. It's pretty cool, just motivates me. Set it on my desk, looking at me all day long as I'm writing. Uh, everybody out there loves Harry Potter. I don't need to sell you on that. But what I wanted to talk about was kind of character development and what you can learn from Harry Potter. Harry Potter is an awesome example of not really an antagonist being in a great character, but the, the role of Snape, you know, in the movies played by Alan Rickman, who unfortunately passed away, and very depressing. Loved him in, you know, Die Hard and every other movie, Love Actually, etc., that he's done. Uh, so very, very sad. Uh, but in the book and in the movie, Alan Rickman's character, Snape, was the probably, in my opinion, the most interesting character in a lot of literature. All literature? I don't know. But I loved him. Like, the whole idea of, of who he is, how he comes to school, falls in love with Lily Potter, or later to be Lily Potter, <laughs> you know, Harry Potter's mom, um, before she marries James Potter. He falls in love with her. They go to separate uh, schools inside of, or inside of Harry, inside of Hogwarts. And it, it's just this awesome story of how he kind of falls into the dark path, you know, the, the force and all that. <laughs> he falls into the dark side and, uh, you know, rats them out to to uh, Voldemort without, I don't want to spoil it, but everybody out there should know Harry Potter. But what's awesome is you can go check out this video on YouTube that somebody put together where it kind of shows chronologically the whole journey of Snape through the movies. And just watch that and, you know, tell me in the comments if your heart doesn't break at that. Because it's, it's, it's gut-wrenching, you know? And so look at Harry Potter for how they don't only make their main characters well-rounded and three-dimensional, but they make side characters. You know, Ron, Hermione, um, Harry, they're all awesome three-dimensional characters, but so, so are the side characters, of course, Neville, Longbottom, and all these other ones, uh, Snape, who throughout kind of plays an antagonistic role, and the, at times you think he's the bad guy, and yeah, you know, turn this video off if you don't want to find out what really happens, <laughs> but at the end he basically sacrifices himself for this whole kind of Dumbledore journey that set him off to protect Harry, in a way, and defeat Lord Voldemort, so... Very interesting character, inspiring story, Harry Potter, one of the best pieces of literature ever. You need to go read it, and that's it.